we're in the languedoc roussillon wine region in France. It's been very interesting so far. Not sure if you've heard of the wine region, it's not very popular in France at all. Historically, it's actually made France's worst wine. And because it's not famous, that's why we're here. Because there are a handful of producers that are creating really awesome wine and the prices aren't that high. So we're off hunting and scouting to find these secret gems that we don't really get in the United States. So what I found so far, the wines here are incredibly aromatic, just bouquets of flowers on the nose. At first I didn't know if the winemakers had a secret trick to doing this, but then after several visits now, I realized that the wines are just very um, aromatic here, which has been nice. It's very hot, and so the region as, in general has very high alcohol levels. So it's a little trickier here to actually get a balanced wine that has a, uh, um, a good balance of acid and alcohol. So the wines here are uh, often over 14%, even up to 15, 15 and a half percent alcohol. So the hotter it is, the more alcohol you have, the less acid. So we're off to find the winemakers who are doing amazing things and being able to create really balanced wines in the area. Importers in general want big quantities and the farmers here have told me so far the two main reasons why they're not importing into the United States is because it's a hassle, there's a lot of regulations, and the reason why importers typically want larger quantities is because they have to put marketing dollars into that wine. Their wines then go to distributors, who go to salespeople, who then go to the restaurants and uh, retail outlets. So if they're gonna put marketing dollars into a wine, they need a lot of it to distribute out. We're different, we're selling directly to people online, so we prefer small batches, we prefer uh, artisan wines, and so these winemakers are really uh, attracted to what we're doing as, as a company. So we're able to go get wine that's in high demand in Europe and start uh, reserving some of the best stuff for ourselves to sell directly to our uh, customers online. It's a good start and we'll be spending more time here and I'm excited to find the, uh, the best wines at the best values and bring them in and share them with you.